Good morning, just had my coffee, ready to go. Today we're gonna do short form two. I'm gonna do it both facing the camera and away from the camera one time so we can do it as if we're doing it in class. So I'm just going to go over just a few details and let's see if we can get this learned the right way. Now, start with a formal salutation. So stepping in. All right, so start with the first part. Now remember low balance, we're just starting with a short salute, then back. Stepping into right fighting stance first, inward block with my right into outward hand sword. Now I'm gonna step straight through forward, now I'm coming in with my left, left inward block, outward hand sword with the left, right hand is checking. From this position, I'm gonna drop back to a cat stance, pull my right hand back into a chamber, and my left fist is just covering right over my right fist. I look over my shoulder. I'm going to step out to the left neutral bone. As I do that, I'm doing an upward block with my left and a straight punch with my right. I'm going to look over my right shoulder, slide my right foot over into a cat stance pointed at 12 o'clock, pull my left hand back to a chamber. Right hand comes covering over the left. I look over that shoulder. I'm going to step out into a right fighting stance, and I'm going to do a block and a punch at the same time. Outward block with the right, straight punch with the left, both happening at the same time. From here, I'm going to step into a twist, a rear twist stance. So I'm going to move my left foot back behind my right, going into a twist stance in this position right here. And as I do that, I'm bringing my arms up. I'm sorry. I'm going to bring my hands into a chamber position over here. So when I rotate out, I'm going to rotate out. And what I'm going to end up doing, I'm going to do it facing the camera first before I turn back in this way. I'm gonna be in a left neutral ball facing the back. And from there, my left arm is gonna do an upward block. My right hand is gonna do a middle knuckle strike, scraping down. What I'm gonna do with that is I'm gonna drop down into a wide kneel. With a wide kneel, I can't drop down because of my injury right now, but you're basically from a neutral bow, you're gonna pick your back heel up and you're gonna drop down as far as you can as you do this. I can't go any further than this because my injury won't let me to go any further, but I need you guys to drop down really low as you do this part. So when I turn back and face this way, that's where I'm going to. So I'm gonna pick it back up from here. I'm with my right leg in front, look over my shoulder, stepping out, outward block with a straight punch, dropping the left foot back behind me into a twist stance position, right handed chamber, left over right, and when I rotate out, I'm gonna bring that left arm up, drop down, middle knuckle strike. From here, I'm gonna take my right leg, I'm gonna cover backwards, take my right foot, step back over here to make sure I have heel to alignment facing this way. Now I'm gonna do the opposite. As I do that, right arm comes up, left hand is gonna uh, go out with middle knuckle strike. I'm gonna pick my left heel up as I drop down, and I go here. So from this part, I'm going down, step back, down, now, from here, I'm gonna rotate over. So I'm spinning on my right leg. So I'm gonna turn my body, point my hips forward into a cat stance to the back 45. And as I do that, right hand is coming down in a forearm strike, left arm is covering right over it. So when I spin out of it, I'm gonna end up right here. So from this position, I'm gonna go from here, rotate over, I'm in a cat stance position, Left over right, I'm gonna step out into a neutral bow as I do a downward block, right hand is chambered back. Then I'm gonna step through forward as I do a heel palm with my right, and I end up in a right neutral bow. Left hand is checking from here. Now I'm gonna rotate over, I'm gonna stand on my left foot. I'm turning my right leg to come back over this side. I'm getting a cat stance, and this side is gonna be right over left. So when I come back from this heel palm here, I'm coming over, Cat stance, right or left. I'm gonna step out right down to a downward block. Left hand is chambered, I'm gonna right fighting stance. Then I'm gonna step through to a left fighting stance. As I do, straight left heel palm, right hand is checking. Now I have to go back to the front 45. So that's gonna be more to that 130. From, from this position, I'm gonna rotate my hips and turn facing 130 into a cat stance. So I'm going from this neutral bow, Rotate to a cat stance as I go with the left inward block. That's my transition. My right hand's coming back to the chamber. So I'm going to go inward block into a cat stance. I'm going to step out into a right neutral bow as I do an extended outward block. 
other hand, my left hand comes back, it's chambered. From here, I'm gonna do a half fist strike. So from here, I'm gonna keep this block up, rotate over, half fist strike, and come back to neutral. Now I'm gonna bring my left foot to the point at the front 45 this way, which is gonna be at 1030. And as I do that, I'm gonna bring my right hand in and do an inward block here. From this inward block position in this cat stance, I'm gonna step out into the neutral bow, left neutral bow, as I do an extended outward block here. I'm gonna rotate, half fist strike, and come back. When I rotate, I'm rotating into a lunge stance, so that's with my heel coming up. So I'm gonna rotate here, strike, and then back. From here, I'm gonna bring my right foot in, meditate horse, and we close, all right? So, I'm gonna face away from the camera, see where we're at, back, all right, that should be good. So from here, step out to meditate horse, step forward with your right, inward block, outward hand sword, step forward with your left now, inward block, outward hand sword, Drop back into a cat stance, keeping that left leg in front. Right hand pulls back, left over right. Look over my left shoulder. I step out, do my left block and a right punch, same time. Now I'm gonna look over my right shoulder, drag my right foot over into a cat stance position. Left hand is chambered, right hand over left. I'm gonna step out into a right fighting stance and at the same time, right block with a left straight punch. From here, I'm gonna take my left foot, drop it to the rear into a twist stance. My hands posi my hand position is my right hand is chamber, left over right. When I rotate out, I'm gonna rotate out, end up in a neutral bow, pick that heel up, left hand goes up, and I'm gonna do middle knuckle strike this way, cover backwards, opposite, right hand comes up, drop down, middle knuckle strike that way. Now I'm gonna go back to the back 45. So I'm gonna rotate over, I'm spinning on my right leg, turn into a cat stance this way, left over right. We're gonna step out as we wipe off and go into a downward block here. Then we're gonna step through forward and we move back this way a little. Then we're gonna step through into a right neutral bow as we do a heel palm. From here, bringing my right foot over, I'm gonna to spin to face the other 45, back 45. So I'm going here, now I'm right over left. In a cat stance, most of my way to my back leg here. I'm gonna step out to a neutral bow, downward block, other hand is to the hand is chambered. Then I'm gonna step through forward, heel palm this way, and I'm gonna left neutral bow. Now I'm gonna spin on my left leg. I'm gonna rotate, turn my hips face this way to go to the front 45 here. So from this heel palm, I'm gonna rotate over, left hand does an inward block while I'm in the cat stance. Then I'm gonna step out and do an extended outward block from a right neutral bow. Left hand does a half fish leg. Rotate over and back. Bring that left foot over, now I'm going to the front 45. Right hand does an inward block. Step out, extend an outward block. And from here, left, I'm sorry, right hand is going to do a half fist strike. Strike in and back. And come up here, and we're back. All right, practice that, and we'll get to the next one in just a little bit.